Mr. Nonsense and Wasa Hargreaves. Mr. Nonsense had no sense at all. No scrap. I mean, he went to a sway. A sway! Can you imagine? Why do you love a sway? Mr. Happy asked him one day. Because, replied Mr. Nonsense, I tried while on the ground, but it was too high up, so I moved to the tree where I could be closer to the ground. What nonsense! So I must happy. Thank you, replied Mr. Nonsense. And do you know what Mr. Nonsense wanted to eat? Paws. Well, no one would die, may say, but paws on toast. For real. Why do I pawns on toes? Mr. Nosey asked him one day. Because, replied Mr. Nosey, I swipe for a thousand and I don't like them. And the other one Mr. Nosey sleeps every night? And I walk about in his bedroom, in his house, I'm a sway. <laughs> well, why is living a wall about? Mr. Strong asked him one day. Because, replied Mr. Nonsense, I tried sleeping in a motorboat, but it was somewhere uncomfortable. Mr. Nonsense lived as the online play was, but in a country called Nonsense Land. Now, I know somebody was in Nonsense Land too. Do y'all? Yep, y'all guessed it, Mr. Sally. Mr. Sally and Mr. Nonsense were close friends and saw a lot of each other. Mr. Nonsense was out of one of Mr. Sally's house playing desktop puzzles. These are sort of inside each other. How silly! And Mr. Sally was out of one of Mr. Nonsense's house playing cards. These are turned out to see who can get the most pieces out of one card. What nonsense! <laughs> However, this story is about the time of snow in Nonsense Land. It did bring out the snow, but when was it dead? Now, tell me, what kind of snow? Nope, and not just when one snows, it does snow white snow. It snows, hear me out. Yellow snow! Tells me why, but it does. Yellow snow. And when Mr. Say woke up one morning, the whole Nazis world was covered in yellow snow. I say! He said when he walked out of his bedroom window. Snow! <laughs> and he was so excited, he walked out to Mr. Nazis' house. Mr. Nonsense was asleep in his bed. Wake up, cried Mr. Silly. Wake up and come wake out of your window. <laughs> Whatever on earth is it? Well, Mr. Nonsense wanted to sleep out of his eyes as he got up and went across his bedroom window. I say, he said, looking out. Custard. This is a custard say banana. <laughs> Clemens is silly. It's no! <laughs> Mr. Nonsense was downstairs. Come on, he called. And that day, Mr. Say and Mr. Nonsense had one of the very best days of their lives. They had a snowball fight. Mr. Say's snowballs were wound. And Mr. Nonsense made a snowball that somehow or other came out so square. <laughs> then they built a snowman. A very silly, nonsensical sort of a snowman. <laughs> it was kind of like Mr. Snow, but he's yellow. <laughs> Come on, said Mr. Nuts this afternoon. Let's go tobogganing. But we don't have tobogganing, said Mr. Silly. Oh no, we don't, agreed Mr. Nuts. Mr. Silly thought. Oh yes we do, <laughs> he said. And Mr. Say went back to Mr. Nonsense's house and came by his bed. Whee! <laughs> they sat together as it slid faster and faster down the hill and their warm book toboggan. That was a wonderful day. A day evening had to have a sat together. Poor as pie. <laughs> Mr. Nonsense decided they played a game. What shall we play? Asked Mr. Silly. The last, said Mr. Nonsense. I forgot to wait last, <laughs> said Mr. Silly. Oh, it's easy, we'll find Mr. Nonsense. And he went round to open all the doors and windows. There we are, he said. The last. What nonsense. <laughs>